Hey, hey, it's Brian Storm, and we're starting to get pretty close to NHL 18. So I figured I'd spend some time investing in an NHL 17 video that I think may be able to benefit us in NHL 18 and throughout the final days of NHL 17. So what we're going to be doing is trying to figure out what the best attribute in NHL 17 is. To do that, we're going to use playoff mode where I've created 16 different teams to duke it out in a battle royale single knockout. All of that's fine. None of that really matters. To determine what is the best stat, best attribute in NHL 17, which I think will also be valid for NHL 18. They don't really change the attributes up too, too much year to year. These are your 16 teams that will be squaring off for the crown. But something like 99 overall speed versus 99 overall acceleration, trying to figure out which of those two are better. It would be interesting to see comes out on top there. And then you have Wist Power versus Wist Accuracy where, you know, it's just power versus accuracy. What's more important? You have Iceland taking on Idaho. After that, you have the Weeshwashers versus Schwinnigan, where hopefully Doc will start saying that girl from Weeshwash if they do end up on top. After that, we have Pissing versus Balancing. How long can you hold your little hockey stick when you're drunk and peeing? So we'll find out there through uh, the 99 overall passing and the logo, the Oilers logo kind of looks like a stream of liquid coming out. So I end up using that there. Then we have Forest Lawn versus Dusseldorf. Slap accuracy and slap power. Zug versus Yoinkers, where we have aggressiveness, aggro versus poise. Offensive awareness and defensive awareness should be interesting. And we chose some really long names there. Just because uh, they're already long enough. Winky face. Finally, Utiliga versus Enderdeder. Enderdeder being the EA Sports logo. And this is agility backwards in case, in case you didn't see that. The way that I had this set up was I started with 85 attributes for every player in the tournament. And then the attribute for a particular team, such as in this case, 99 overall speed. And this applies to each player on the team. Centers, defensemen, left wing, right wing, except for this guy. Why is he 84 overall? Why did he have to go and ruin everything? Hang on, I gotta, gotta change that real quick. Uh, a little boo-boo. Relax. Let me kiss that for him. And it's 99 overall. All right, as I was saying before I got rudely interrupted by myself. So what we're going to do in this tournament... So what we're going to do in this tournament is we're going to watch each game play out. You guys get to listen to my lovely commentary because I do not trust the simulation. Some weird stuff has happened with the simulations over the years. Like there could be like a 10 to 1 overtime win and it just, just just doesn't make sense so here we go the first matchup it's cowtown versus butt i don't know why the offensive and defensive stats are like this but i guess speed makes a huge difference in the overall stats apparently as a commentator i cannot edit the lines of either of the teams that is very disappointing some players to watch out for on the butt squad include Kevin Bieksa because he's an NHL player, though the stats really don't matter because all their stats are the same. So we're trying to figure out who, who seems like they might stand out. Maybe the intangibles such as leadership and experience will come into play for him. Another player to look out for is David Booth because you never know if his Halloween card is going to come out instead. For Cowtown, we have 85 overall, Hrabarenka, Raman, Raman Hrabarenka. Look at how those R's and A's just blend together and you have no idea whether they're an A or an R. 
I love this guy's name, so I think I think he's gonna be someone to watch out for. The fucking all star Danny Heatley finds himself in Cowtown. So fucking all star. I mean, sorry, Danny. Did you see this uh, trade coming at all? Yeah. No. Yeah. I don't know, actually. You know, is that fucking Walmart buying some, uh, one of my fucking, uh, All-Star sticks here, and I got a phone call on the, my cell phone saying you're fucking traded. So I was like, what the fuck you talking about? Whatever, fuck. So, then I hung up on him. Here we are in the Aces Arena in the butt, and... Whoa, 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 whoa. Wait, why are you commentating? I'm the one commentating. I'm gonna, I'm gonna just skip these guys and, uh, take care of this. Don't you worry. No, 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 I'm still hearing your voice in my head. Let's get rid of that. And here we go. Ready for game one of the tournament between Cowtown and Butt. I believe yellow is the one with 99 overall speed, and green, white and green away jerseys, are the ones with 99 acceleration. If you guys haven't seen me commentate, or not really commentate, but be the coach in my franchise mode. Highly recommend you check that out because I had a lot of fun commentating on that game. That's why I wanted to do something like this. Right now I'm not even commentating on the game that's happening right now as Harold has the puck and the 85 overall passing shows up as he misses a really weird pass. B. Jones, maybe it's Brian Jones, maybe it's not, dumps the puck in. And now Booth, 99 speed, has the puck, passes it to Bull, gets laid out as the away team is going into the offensive zone or defensive zone. What I don't know, whichever zone that is. Oh, pass in front of the net! Nice backhander. It is currently a 4v3 power play. Oh no, it's not, as apparently people are just hiding from the camera. The away team going in. Slap shot. Doesn't doesn't do much as that was from a really bad angle passes it around cycling a little bit weird pass trying to get through players the poke check comes out and then the skates come out bailey going in right now dumps it is oh my god is this just gonna be everybody dumping the puck that's boring let's get something to happen right now the speed team dumps it in as well Nice hit, nice four check, but he's the only one on the four check. What's going on there? I can't, I can't change anyone's strategy. Well, that sucks. Look, look at that, those dangles by Heat. That's not Heatley. That's number four. I swear there was a Heat in his name. Oh, whatever. Another dump. He Jones. There is a penalty for the yellow team, the the, the piss color team. As not Bell, but this other dude, who I can't read the name of because uh, the colors are kind of bad. As the away team, the 99 overall acceleration team, has a power play. Nice shot! That's probably the first really good opportunity of the game. Yellow team clears the puck. It's the away team. 99 acceleration. They can reach their top speed a lot sooner. While the yellow team is the one... Oh, nice pass. The yellow team is the one that's going to uh, go a lot faster in the long run or something like that. Oh, there, there's my boy! 92 in the back! He's a defenseman! Give it give it to my boy! Krabarenka or something. Hartzell, what are you doing? What was that? Yeah, yeah, ref, wave your hand like that. What? Get, oh, don't do that. That's bad. Yep, that's like every every initial game in a nutshell right there. There's now a four on four. Twenty seconds to go for the uh, penalty for the speed team. Not seeing much happening right now, but I think the speed team is about to make something happen as they get the first goal of the game. Hartzell, that is all your fault, man. Forget oh, look at Steven Booth! Holy crap, his Halloween card actually comes out with the nice snipe and right in front of the net. Oh, look at that gorgeous pass. It all starts with the face-off on the 4-on-4 on four by Desi Money. He actually loses it, but fights off two dudes at the same time. He's able to grab the puck. Goes into the corner. 
makes a nice Brian Storm-like pass, because that's what I love to do, make that pass right there. And then we have Bichanik. He passes it right back into the corner. Jesse Money tries to pass it to the high slot. Gets poke checked. So an assist coming from Gomez, number 13. As Booth sees this puck all by its lonesome self. And with the screen is able to get the first goal of the game. Let's see that celebration. That's a team celebration. Damn it, you didn't do the individual celebration I gave you. I'm, I'm disappointed. Just like that, it is 1-0 for Team Speed. It's a quick dump around the corner and a dump right back. Gets us into the offensive zone. Give it give it to my boy in the... Oh, oh okay, that's fine. Or do that. Take that slap shot. I want from... from... from Banka. Barkaharka. Barkaharka to get the puck. Marchon Tuoni was taking the face off for, for Team Away. Booth has the puck again. Doesn't do anything with it. Oh, but uh, actually the forecheck. The forecheck might mean he's going to do something with it. No, no. It's going to go the other way. As Marchon Tuoni this goes in. Harrison doing some nice spins. Oh, look at these passes. Rochabanka! No, 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 it's okay. Gratton. Krachabanka again! Ah, oh, the one-timer just barely misses. Macaroni with the puck. No, Macaroni gives it up. That's okay. Got a uh, four-on-four, four-on-three developing here. Hartzell covers the puck. So that is period number one. With Team Acceleration getting... Uh, most of the opportunities, yet Team Speed is up one nothing. Maybe home ice advantage has something to do with it, because there are a lot of yellow jerseys out there. Second period, starting up, Brookbank, BX, uh, the player to watch, passes it to Desi Money. Desi Money with the shot. Hartzell, nice save. That is a very good opportunity for Speed. They have two quality shots, probably thanks to their speed, but I don't know. Both Joneses on a line right now with Booth. Or maybe the Joneses are on the other team. I don't know. Another nice shot. That loose puck almost went in. Yeah, it is the other team. Higgins is actually with the Joneses. Whew! Off the iron. Higgins, nice pass to Hayda. To Jones. Almost tied it up there. One of the Joneses almost tied it up there. Bieksa, what were you doing? Passing it to your goalie like that. The away team wins the puck. Two on two right now, but now it's two on three. So he's just going to dump the puck. Drazanovic to Bell. Now it's a three on three. As they enter the zone, Drazanovic back to Bell. Harrison makes a great defensive play, but here comes the fucking all-star with the play of the century. Watch, watch, watch. Nice, nice toe drag. No, play of the century was actually him losing the puck. Apparently. Sorry. We might still highlight that. Look at that nice... Uh, Strydeek, but the pass didn't work out. He's going for that Crosby type of one-timer. Gomez ties it up. Nice pass to the slot for the one-timer. I don't know who that pass is from. It was from Halischuk. Halischuk and Harrison. Nice one-timer. Two refs. These two refs are just like watching. That they're just looking, looking forward. Oh my god, huh? it's creepy. And they're just skating together. And and this player just just goes right by him. The ref continues to stare forward for some reason. Slowly turns around. No, no, not, not uh, very, very slowly. Someone's got to improve the agility rating on this referee. Because, uh, this is this the part where we score? Or, not we, but I thought they had the green team scores. Yeah, so he kind of, like, missed half of what happened there. Probably, like, stoned out of his mind. And his reaction to that goal? Man, what the hell am I doing here? He's still sitting there after the goal. Oh, yeah, but yeah. Oh, forgot we had a play to, to look at. Okay, so... First of all, we gotta challenge this for an offside because I don't know why not. I didn't. I didn't see anything happen. 
Here we go. All three players coming at the same time. Puck goes in first. It's a good goal. It is a good goal. He passes it between two players. And here comes a uh, Gomez. Goes right through Mr. Defenseman Frendo, B-Bell. And takes a nice shot blocker side. B-U-T-A-F-O. Look at this puck. So authentic. Wait, 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 wait for it. Wait for it. Here it comes. Boom! Right in the face. It's 1-1. We're about halfway through the second period. Gomez with the first goal, like I said already multiple times, probably. Hayes has the puck. Gets robbed. Doesn't actually get robbed because he had pepper spray on him. And then Bull gets the puck. Desi Money gets poke checked. That's okay. Desi Money still wants to go with this puck. Passing it to Bull. Then to no one. What Where? What were you doing? Frabarenka. No, Frabarenka makes a bad play. No. Why are we watching him? Why are we watching him? That's two to one. I feel like I'm biased <laughs> right now because I'm saying no after speed scored. And then... Uh, Yes, after uh, acceleration scored. But nice takeaway. And then the pass is full heart. So he had, he had no idea what was happening there. But yes, Sriracha Sauce. Just just not making a good play here. Oh, that's actually, this is before. So right here, like, we, we, you had five people on him. What were you doing? This, this one dude being a warrior. Who are you? Why are you a warrior? Bull. Yeah, that's you. You're a warrior. Actually, you actually got help from, from friend over here. That's okay. But then Bull gets it. Pass. Pass again. And that goes top shelf. Look at the goalie positioning. Hartzell. Man, what are you doing? What are you doing? I'm not a professional video editor, alright? Relax. But look at that. Wait, what the hell? Wait, 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 whoa, 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 So we have, we have the, the, the stick bending. That, that's kind of cool. I didn't, I've never seen the stick bend that much in the game. But look how, look how the puck is, is on the ice. Oh, no, and then it elevates. That actually just looked like it was from a bad angle. And then goes right over his glove. There's no slow motion. This is too fast. I'm, I'm lightly tapping the right trigger. All right, whatever. So it's two to one. Team speed. Now it's actually halfway through the game. Unless it, uh, you know, goes into overtime. Does he money? Oh, look at that kick fake. Passes it to Bichonic. Bichonic nice shot all by himself. Fournier gets tied up along the boards. Booth with the puck again. Oh, nice pass to the front of the net. And the green team, away they go. Toe drag to Himmel's son by himself. It is 2-2. Two, two. All right, we're not looking at every replay. These guys are already scoring more than I thought they would, honestly. <laughs> well, that windmill deke pass to Bailey. To the open brook bank, I think that was. Gilardi, Gilardi, somebody. And now they're up by one yet again. Back and forth they go. In before I get a contract from EA making me the newest announcer and commentator. Color comp, whatever. I I'm actually not familiar with those terms. Gratton right in front of the net. Somebody passes the puck back, gets stuffed, but the stick breaks, so nothing can come out of that one. The stickless Gratton in the corner goes after this guy. No, doesn't work out. Nice job blocking the shot. Bailey. The Bumblebee Bailey. No, nothing happens there. Harold gets plowed by Bumblebee Bailey. And the yellow team still has the puck. BX a nice shot. Still 3 2. 9 to 7 faceoffs. One should be 8 to 8 because all your faceoff ratings are the same. That's bullshit. That's a lie. Toe drag pass. Pass right back. Higgins to the open man Harold. Nice save by the other goalie, Emery. Doesn't look black from here. Jones in front of the net. Nice shot, nice shot. Drazinovich to Bell. 
Bell loses the drag. Somebody lost the puck. Bell has it again. Bell going in. Going right in. What the hell were you doing right there? Why didn't you get that? And why didn't you keep going? This, could also be, this video could also be used to make fun of the um, AIs for making some interesting decisions. Weird clear. Is that an icing? No, it's not an icing. Hartzell comes out. Harrison. And with five seconds left. Nothing happens. It's 3-2 after 2. As both teams try to stay alive in the playoffs. Though technically, they'll try to stay alive no matter what game they play. Because it's just a single knockout game. Jones, look at those moves, Jones. Higgins doesn't do anything with the rebound. Friendo goes uh, goes places. Doesn't get rid of that puck. Booth and Bell are going in. Now Brookbank. Can he be the Carlson of this team right now? No, he just dumps it. Boring. B. Jones. B. Jones to uh, Higgins. Higgins going in. Two on two. Developing. Nice toe drag. Oh, into a windmill deke. Maybe not actually nice, but I mean, it just it just happened. Okay, it happened. The four check. And back to center ice it goes. They enter the offensive zone. Try to go for a very quick one-timer there. And then a one-timer with a, with a backhand. That's not really going to work out too well, I don't think. Alice Chuck all by himself. 1v3. A smart play to make. To uh, get line changes, I hope. Maybe. Oh, this is the Carlson right here. He's going in as... Never mind. Emery does not get a penalty while trying to go for the puck behind the net. That, that is how you're supposed to do it. That windmill deke. Nothing. Heater, Heater's not going to get bumped off the puck. Yeah, okay. That's not going to happen. The fucking all-star going in right now. Makes a pass. Him making a pass is kind of weird. Here comes the yellow team. Cycling the puck around. Oh my god, Bailey! No, no, nothing. Krabarenka, come on, man. Be the highlight of your team. The MVP, the star. You can do it. Or your name isn't... Cha-cha-cha. Gilardi, oh, nice try. Centering that pass. Gomez leading the rush right now. His teammates on the opposite side. Surprisingly, no offsides have happened. No, offside. Oh, offside. Yeah, sure. Uh, the, the Bud 99 overall speed squad. They've, they've, they've done a nice job hitting. You know, look at look at these fucking big hits. Oh my god. That dude got hit. Back to you guys. They should be looking to pull their goalie if they're the Colorado Avalanche right now under uh, Patrick Waugh. But no, they will not. As the L team gets the puck back, goes in, dumps it like they always do. But win the puck right back. Corrente gets it to the front of the net. That could have been 4-2. The insurance maker or marker, depending on who you ask. If you ask me, it's maker. If you ask uh, someone who commented on my video earlier, calling me an idiot for saying it's maker and it's actually marker, then it's marker. But... Point is, it's 3-2, and nothing like that has happened yet. These guys are skating very weirdly right now. D. Jones with the windmill. And the stick lift. Corrente to Chip Chura, Arizona's favorite. Kyle Chip Chura does nothing. D. Jones along the wing. Goes deep with the puck. Gets rammed along the boards. But D. Jones is there. Harold to Hayda. Back to Harold. Slap shot. Nothing. Bichanek kicks the puck left. Corrente with a minute left in the game. Green team has to pull their goalie. If they don't, then they'll still have five players on the ice. Plus the goalie. Heatley. Oh my god. That is Heatley. What the hell? I don't remember him wearing them. Uh, I'm just being stupid, I think.
That would have been a nice pass if that, that slap shot was a pass. Oh, now they're pulling their goalie. 30 seconds left, but the yellow team gets it. And why is there no pressure on these yellow guys? Oh, there we go. That's that's the pressure I'm looking for. As the yellow team cycles the puck around, and they lose it. The dump and chase play with Halischuk to Hayda. Slap shot. That was a bad slap shot. 10 seconds left. Anything can still happen like this. That happened, ladies and gentlemen, as the rebound finds its way into the back of the net. Jared Gomez, two goal night right now. Being the hero for this acceleration squad, the hero that Tuchanka couldn't be. A nice backhand. We're going OT, continuous OT. None of this shootout crap. These are your stats. Acceleration, overrunning, speed in terms of the stats, I guess. But 21 hits for team speed. Who will go to the second round of the Brian Storm tournament? We're about to find out here. The ref drops the puck. The L team wins it. Desi Money with a weird dumping shot and a weird pass. That's okay, Desi Money. That's okay. Bieksa gets laid out. BX is screwing his team over. Higgins has the puck. Nothing happens. Desi Money. Bieksa again. Bad pass. Screwing his team over again. To Jones. To Hayda. I didn't know Bieksa would be this entertaining to watch with his fuck ups. Gets tied up along the boards. Desi Money has it. As the money is going to break out himself. As he passes it to the goalie. That usually goes in. Probably not in this game. That's okay. As the money gets the puck. He probably wants a line change. But his teammates just keep passing him the puck. And he's like, what the hell, guys? As they lose the puck in the offensive zone. Heater gets a breakaway all by himself. Oh, that acceleration right there, I think, gave him the speed that he needed to get right by that guy. And that forces... Wait, Heater, you're the one that got the penalty? Why? You had a breakaway. And now you screw up the game. Great. I mean, unbiasedly speaking, it is now a power play. For one team. And a penalty kill for another. Penalty kill for another. Penalty kill for another. Penalty kill for another. BX side in the corner. On this power play. Bell. He wants to be the OT hero right now. Passing it to BX to someone else. That probably wouldn't go interference. That's okay. That pass just went underneath the goalie. Gallardi with a very weak uh, clear. But Frendo over here fights for the puck. Chipchura. Kyle Chipchura passes it to Gallardi. Gallardi gets knocked down. 20 seconds left on this penalty kill slash power play. The XA passes it to Drazinovic, who's probably a little too fast for his own good. Chipchura manages to lose the puck. Tries to figure out what to do, and he just gives it up. Okay, that's great. Hayda, nice spin. Passing it to Heatley, who just got out of the penalty box, who just passes it to the L team, who is now breaking out with a really weak shot onto Hartzell. The L team wins the puck to Frendo. Krichabananka with the puck. Krichabananka with the pass. And he draws the penalty, Krichabananka. Making plays right now. This is good. This is good. This could lead to the GWG. Game winning goal for anyone who does no acronyms. Good try in front of the net, but not good enough. Wasn't goal. Somebody went to the penalty box. Forgot to check who. So, sucks to suck. Raphael goes to the penalty box. What were you doing on that play? No, seriously, I want to know just because I don't know. 
Somebody has the puck right now. Somebody passes it back. Krabarenka! You should have shot that Krabarenka. Very bad hockey IQ, but that's okay. Now pass it from that. That's nice. Heatley. Almost got it done. Minute left on the power play. Okay. Should I even comment on what happened there? Is that something that is commentatable? Probably not. So, you guys should just like edit edit that part out, and you guys will just see. Wait, why did it just like skip over five seconds? It's weird. Higgins wins the face off. The team on the power play wins the face off. Halschuk by himself. What's he gonna do here? He's gonna take a backhand. No, he's not. He gets poked by Emery. Higgins passes it back to the point. Hayda's gonna go in now. Nice between legs, Deke, and a backhand that was kind of weak, but good opportunity for a rebound. The power play is now over. We're back to even strength with six minutes to go. What was that? It was to force an offside, clearly. 23 hits. Does speed lead to hitting? I don't know. Apparently. Though, I didn't really take into account like any of their sizes or anything. So maybe yellow just has a bigger team. Let's try with one time in front of that. But, the, but green team has Heatley. Like, big dude. He probably has all, like, ten hits of the green king. Cycling around, Harold with the shot. The redirect. Thomas win. Four minutes left in the overtime. Passing it around town. Jones loses it. Nice stick lift to keep the puck in the offensive zone, but no. As the yellow team is able to get out. Krabarenka. Krabarenka gives it up for that opportunity to happen. Very disappointing. Jones. Nice pass to Higgins. Goes in deep. Passes it to the point. Back to Higgins. Back to the point. Across. Krabarenka with the shot that went nowhere. The money to BXA to Booth. The other Halloween card. It's Halloween versus Halloween right here. Except, uh. Yeah, they're not really wearing good costumes. Marina nice save. Minute 24 left in. OT number one. Ref drops the puck. Yellow team wins, and Brooksbank has the puck. Passes over to somebody who's being covered by the boards right now. So, I don't know who this guy is, but he gave up the puck. I can't yell at him if I don't know his name. Hayes gets the puck. Hayes passes it to the middle. Back to Hayes. Back to the middle. And it's over! The team that I wanted to win! I mean, uh, Team Acceleration wins! Clearly proving that Acceleration is better than Speed. And these guys are celebrating like they just won the Brian Storm Cup. Oh, oh, we got handshakes. I've actually never seen this. That's pretty cool. Yeah, it's over. You guys were losers. Sorry. Accuracy for the win. Or not accuracy. Shit. Acceleration for the win. Speed sucks. Yeah. These are your highlights. Nice windmill deke. Oh, that was the rebound. The windmill deke. It's us, the rebound goal, and that's the final goal right there. As Cowtown is better than Team Button. Your three stars of the game is Gomez with a two-goal night, but Desi Money, or DeSimon, actually. The, the capitalization isn't shown on the jerseys. I wouldn't have guessed that. But he had two assists. And Gillies with the goal. I think that was the OT goal. Here's that. As I was saying, Team Acceleration overrunning Team Speed mostly. Just anything but hits, really. And that is the first game of round one. Let me know if you guys enjoyed that. If you want to see more of that, then you should definitely uh, 
I guess stay tuned to the series because next time we're going to have a show win again versus Weishwasher where it's stick check versus puck control or ball control, depending on how experienced you are with hockey. If you're not very experienced, you probably call it a ball. With that said, thanks for watching, guys. Make sure you like and subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll see you guys around.